Yeah, my name is Anton Mikhailov and I am a research and development engineer in Magic Lab in PlayStation. So my role on Project Morpheus is the camera tracking. So the, the tracking system is composed of inertial tracking and optical tracking. So the optical tracking is done by me, the inertial tracking is done by Eric Larson. We've been working on the tracking part for quite a long time. It's actually an evolved version of the PlayStation Move tracking system. So, you know, that work goes back, you know, six, six years now or something. But the current version with the the six LEDs on the Morpheus headset. It's probably about a year and a half old. The, cam the camera was designed to handle, you know, optical tracking essentially. So we're able to track many peripherals. Um, you know, we had a lot of experience on PS3 with Move. So when we designed the PS4 camera, we made sure that it's capable of doing, you know, these kind of peripheral tracking things. Well, was, the camera was designed to, with tracking peripherals in mind. Morpheus, the DualShock, uh, the you know, move controller. So basically anything with a light on it, I wrote the vision tracking for it and then Eric wrote the inertial tracking. The Morpheus project's been a really cool culmination of all of the research that we've been doing lately. So I, on the software side, I worked on the castle demo. So I did sort of the demo design and the game flow and then uh, Richard Sensen worked on the graphics and Jeff Stafford also helped with the game design. So yeah, we all, we make tech demos to, you know, test our code and show the developers, you know, what we think is cool. A, I mean, it's an in internal tech demo that R&D we use to kind of test the system, right? Because when you're testing things like tracking and displays, it's, it's much better to have kind of a use case in mind, right? You don't want to test on grids and boxes and stuff like that. If you have a gameplay usage, you can actually feel like how the experience is evolving. So yeah, we use that demo and we add stuff to it just for fun. Yeah, so every show, you know, we improve it a bit and then people say, oh, and now I want to do X, right? So yeah, so. We're going to see what we can do about the various uh, improvements that people have requested. It's pretty exciting to see you know, that tech demo kind of become one of the big demos for Morpheus. So yeah, that's it's pretty surprising and exciting. Well, for, for the time being, we're focused on the games market. So Project Morpheus is going to be you know, basically PS4 targeted. But there's a lot of other applications that you know, we're, we have in research. So on PlayStation 3, we had a project called Move.me. And that allowed uh, researchers and a lot of like, rehabilitation people use the move controllers for tracking. Uh, so we have some history in doing you know, non-game applications and lately we've had a partnership with NASA working on the NASA exploration. So you know, we have a lot of non-game projects in the research phase but we don't have anything to announce right now. So I'm actually a terrible person to talk to about the future. I'm a kind of in the now, get it done guy. Uh, I don't really like speculating but I think VR has a really bright future and there's a lot of stuff still to be you know, found out and tweaked and it's really exciting.